God damn, the 49ers just absolutely beat the dog shit out of the Eagles. Like, it wasn't even competitive. Like, bro, I'm making this video right now. Niners up 42-19. There's still four minutes left. Like, that's how disrespectful the 49ers came into Philly, by the way. They thought this was a matchup. Nah, this is a mismatch. Leading up to the game, a lot of people were wondering why the 49ers were favored. Do you see the score right there? The Niners don't just dominate teams. They dominate good teams. 49ers bully the bully. And they were spearheaded by Debo Samuel, who stood on motherfucking business today. He was talking that shit leading up to the game, saying James Bradbury was trash, and he meant it. Look at that. He's scored three touchdowns three touchdowns and shit that man pulled up in black air forces what did you expect in an all black fit come on now that's debo damn and you know this is really just a shit talking video i'm not even gonna break down a damn game eagles fans y'all were talking all that shit last year talking about oh brock purdy was hurt oh it's a part of the game your quarterback got hurt shut the fuck up y'all look stupid as fuck right now i mean look at this stupid ass tweet from this eagles fan saying they not losing to this geek yeah you're not losing to this geek. you're getting dominated by this geek because not only did brock purdy come into philadelphia lincoln financial field the stadium that rocky built he put up four tutties on y'all bitch asses four tutties that's my motherfucking quarterback to be honest jalen hurts without the best offensive line since the great wall of dallas a fucking bolitnikov might not even bolitnikov heisman trophy winner at wide receiver and the second coming of megatron he would just be fucking pat white if he didn't have them talking about brock purdy's the only fucking quarterback that has a special team i thought jalen hurts was gonna go outside i'll give him some respect for coming back into the game because marcus mariota was not gonna cut it but what do you expect from the eagles i mean all last year they didn't play anyone good they didn't play any quarterbacks brock purdy got hurt they didn't play a good team and then when they finally played a good team with a good quarterback the kansas city chiefs they lost the damn super bowl now to focus back on the 49ers the real team that matters here they are just so damn dominant they now beat dallas and philly 42 to 19 and 41 to i don't even know how many points dallas scored fucking 10 the Niners are the best team in the league if they stay fully healthy i don't see how any team touches them they're winning the super bowl if they stay healthy you heard it here first i did think it was funny how the niners gave the eagles a chance and went three and out in their first two drives but then continuously score touchdowns on their next six possessions they could not stop them in philly this defense is a, it's a okay defense, but against this San Francisco 49ers team, come on, man. This is the San Francisco motherfucking 49ers, baby. The Niners defense did just enough against this Eagles offense. I mean, they were just playing sound to sound with football. They were making a lot of plays, but they were playing their lanes, rush lanes, playing their zone coverages, and making Jalen really have to scramble in order to complete some passes. Mooney Ward strapped up A.J. Brown. It wasn't even close. Nick Bosa was still able to apply pressure, even with Lane Johnson false starting on every single fucking play. That shit is crazy. It's a false start. I don't care what the nfl says they got to start doing something about it and man i'm just really proud of this damn team they talked that shit last year this is the exact outcome that would have happened last year don't even get me started on this weak ass calling on Drake greenlaw getting kicked out because fucking peter griffin want to start putting hands on players look at nick sirianni snitch ass saying to kick 57 out the damn game this is your coach this man's a fucking but what's the excuse gonna be this week eagles fans y'all got fucking humbled y'all got fucking embarrassed today embarrassed today look at debo samuel going to the house it was starting to smell like fucking moldy ass cheese. Them cheese steaks gonna be cold tonight. Look at look at my boy Ayuk sliding right here. Ah Eagles fans, when you address the 49ers, address them as your father because we own you, we sunned you. This is exactly the outcome that would have happened last year. So when you speak on the San Francisco 49ers, Debo Samuel, Brock Purdy, Kyle Shanahan, you better put some fucking respect on it. Oh yeah, and I'm gonna leave you with one last thing. Cry, Eagles cry. Ha <laughs> ha!